So welcome back. In this video, we'll talk about left shift and right shift operator. Now what exactly left and right shift operator? So it is, it's, it's also a bit wise operator. So what is left shift? So let's say we have a variable which is a and the value for a is let's say 15. Okay. Let's make it a bit easy. Let's take the value as 8. So if your a value is 8 and I'm creating a new variable which is b and a and we are using a left shift operator on a by 2 okay now when I apply this 2 so first we have to find the binary format of 8 which is 1 0 0 0 which is 3 0 so this is 8 right whenever you apply a left shift operator this left shift operator will shift this number by 2 bits because you have mentioned 2 here now when I say it will shift by 2 bits so we let's say we have 0 0 0 it will uh, append 2 more zeros Okay, just imagine we have a dot here. So it will come to this point and it will add two more zeros. So this is your new number. And this is, this is how much? This is 32, right? So this number here, uh, it represents 32. So if I try to print the value of B, it should be 32. So let's say, uh, let's run this. And it's 32, right? This is, this is how you work with left shift operator. Uh, will it only append 0 or it will append 1? Whenever you use left, left shift operator, it will add extra zeros, okay, not 1. So that's why you're getting the value as 32. Now let's talk about right shift operator. In right shift operator, let's say your value is again 8 and if uh, this time you're using right shift, so you're going inwards. So what we'll do is we'll have this value which is 1, 0, 0, 0 and then we have a dot. So whenever you use right shift, it will send this number two bits this side on the right side. So it will skip these two zeros, right? And the value will be one zero, which is two. And if I run this code, answer should be two. Simple, right? So that is right shift operator. Let's change the number. Let's make it 25. So if I use the number 25, which the binary format for 25 is double one, uh, double zero one. And when you apply a right shift operator by two bits, it will, lose, it will lose this two bits, okay? It doesn't matter if that bit is one or zero, it will lose this two bits. So if you remove this two bits here, the value will be double one zero, okay? Because we are removing the last two bits. So the output should be, so bit one, one zero is equal to six, okay? And when you run this code, that's six. So that's how you use, left shift and right shift operator so that's from this video so do uh, if you have, if, it was, if it was helpful then like the video and do subscribe for for the videos so thank you so much for watching